Welcome to Record Rundown because it's Friday. This will be for the week of October 24th. 2017. I mean, when this is going up, it's Friday. I'm actually recording this before that, and you might not actually be watching this on the day it was posted, so it might not really be Friday. <laughs> Jesu Joy of Man's Desiring isn't inherently about Christmas, but they went ahead and made it about Christmas anyway, because it's still October! Don't mean a thing if it ain't got that swing. The same beautiful world. What's better than one New Orleans jazz trumpeter? Two New Orleans jazz trumpeters. Singing! One of the greatest rock and roll singers of all time with his 11th album, and his second being backed by the sensational Space Shifters. This album is supposed to apparently be a bit biographical about St. Vincent. Fun fact though, Kamasi Washington, who we talked about a few weeks ago, is on pills. The song, the song on the album, like track two, he's not actually on pills, as far as I know. So this album was produced alongside Greg Kirsten, and nearly every single instrumental part on this album was played by Beck or Kirsten. So there you go for multi-talented instrumentalists. I get the, I get the, I get the back. They get the back, have to cut it in half. Stop the comparing, y'all making me laugh. Need to rehab, I'm addicted to cash. Convertible walk, convertible top. If you look at the credits for this album, there are just so many people involved, which I really guess is par for the course for rap albums these days. I have this plan for like if Darude Sandstorm ever makes it back on the charts, whether it be in a compilation album or a remaster, but the idea is just let the song play through the intro sequence. And now I need some help from the maestro, please! I don't really care if you cry, I don't really shouldn't have a lie, should've saw the way she looked me in my eyes. Remember when I said I have nothing more to say about this album a few weeks ago? I still have nothing more to say about this album. Now they always say congratulations. congratulations. So hard, to vacation. They never had a Go watch my video on Rockstar. <laughs> Recording started in 2013, first single released in 2015, and now at the end of 2017, we finally have the album. I get the, I get the, I get the back. They get the back, have to cut it in half. Stop the comparing, y'all making me laugh. Need to rehab, I'm addicted to cash. Convertible walk, convertible top. Out of the 17 tracks on the album, only six feature no guest artist. I gave flack to rap albums for having too many people involved, but pop music is no different. This album has 14 producers, including Pink. Now go enjoy your weekend with all this new music, unless you're listening to this at a different point in time, in which case it might not even be the weekend, but you should listen to all this music anyway. And now I need some help, my stove, please! My stove.